Hello? Place the money into a sports bag and leave it behind the red trash can at Tompkins Park. You have 30 minutes remaining. Sorry, who's this? Make sure all the money is in unmarked bills and in large denominations or we will kill him. You now have 29 minutes remaining. Sorry, I think you got the wrong number. Hang on a second. Isn't this 415-202-3138? No, this is 415-202-3136. Actually, now that I look at it, I wrote the bloody number down wrong. Sometimes my sixes look like eights. Right. Sorry, what was all this you were talking about, putting unmarked bills into a bag in Tompkins Park? Uh, laundry. Laundry, right. Anyway, gotta go. Hello? If the money isn't there on time, his death will be on your hands. Actually, I'm gonna stop you there. I've done it again, haven't I? Fuck. So, are you dialing out the phone number every time? Yeah, so what? Why don't you just save the number into your address book and then just scroll down to that and call that number? Yeah, that's a good idea, actually. I've desperate bad handwriting, I do. Now, tell me the truth. Have you gone and abducted some fella and are holding them for ransom? Is that what's happening? Yeah. Okay, so why didn't you just tell me that earlier on rather than going on about this laundry thing? Don't know. I was embarrassed to tell you the truth, I suppose. So who did you kidnap? Was it like a celebrity, regular person, politician, what? He's just like a regular person. A regular person. Okay, first piece of advice. No one cares about regular people. They only care about celebrities. Hang on, let me get a pen to take this down. Any other ideas? So, how much did you ask for? A million. A million? A million for a regular person? Like, who has that money lying around? They've been slow enough to pay up, in fairness. I wouldn't like to kill the fella. He's sound enough. Have you seen the movie All the Money in the World? Hmm. I don't know that movie now. So, it's the one where uh, Kevin Spacey was fired because he was fiddling with children and then they replaced him with Christopher Plummer? Oh, yeah, yeah. I know the one you're talking about now. Is it any good? Yeah, I mean, it's pretty good. It's got 77% on Rotten Tomatoes. But anyways, that's beside the point. The point is that in that movie, what they do is they cut off the guy's ear who they kidnapped, and they send that to the family to encourage them to pay. Have you tried anything like that? Right, right. They do something similar in The Big Lebowski, but they cut off someone's toe. Like that film. Shut the fuck up, Donnie. Classic movie. Yeah, The Big Lebowski is one of my favorite movies. Anyways, thanks for all the advice. I might try some of that out. I'm um, glad to help. My name is Declan, by the way. I'm Brian. Brian Higgins. Uh, you're not going to tell on me, are you? Uh, well, I don't know who you are, or so how could I tell on you? Well, you know my phone number, and I accidentally gave you my full name there a second ago, so it shouldn't be too hard for you to find me. I won't tell you. You seem sound enough. Anyways, goodbye. Bye. 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 Bye.